Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome to more Let's Play Fallen Fantasy VI! This time, we're doing this. Because, why explain what's happening when I can let the characters do it for me? The Imperials were headed for the sealed gate! They said they found some statues or something. Uh-oh. It couldn't be! Oh, those half-witted espers. To think they would open the gate for us themselves! The warring triad is waiting just beyond that door. I need only reach out and claim it for my own, and all of my dreams will be fulfilled! Hurry it up! Well, that's ominous. What's wrong, Terra? <clears throat> eh, my throat. No, my throat is fine. Um. <laughs> the island! Something's happening! The earth is crying out! Wait a second. What? Okay, so, several things just went wrong here. For starters... <laughs> so this is the power of the Warring Triad. With this, and my Magisite, you mean Kefka's Magisite. The world will be mine to command! Assuming Kefka is yours to command. I mean, he has been so far, so... That's probably a safe assumption. The source of all magic! The Warring Triad! Those things? They're said to have turned themselves to stone! Facing one another! That way, each one's powers would be neutralized by those of the other two! If the three... You know, this isn't quite right. It should be more... Hmm... Yeah, whatever. Whatever! If the three were moved out of their perfect alignment! The resulting power imbalance would destroy the world as we know it! Um... Yeah. So that's another thing that's gone wrong. Um... So... As I said last time, this is sort of pressing and we need to really hurry up to save the world as we know it. So naturally, we are going to do side quests. But first, I need to fix up my party. So I'll meet you on the world map when I have done that. Uh, talk to you in a minute. And we're back. Sort of. I need to figure out where I am first and let's see... 
Is this? Yeah, it's still here. Okay. Um, where the hell am I? Over the Velt, I think? Yeah, this is the Velt. Um, okay. I know where I am now. I need to go this way. And up. No, not. Ah! You see, this is why I complained about the map thing and the airship. This is too hard for me to orient myself properly. Also, okay, that helps a lot. Having the freaking mini map. I am trying to get to here. Ha ha! Narsh! And by the way, this is what our party looks like right now. I know it doesn't look very different. That's because we're gonna need to. I'm gonna need Strago for later on, so I may as well keep him in. And. Well, my motivation for keeping these two around is a little bit different. Which will not immediately become obvious, but you'll. Well, you'll see it when you see it. Now then, we are here for. If I can remember how to get to it. I believe it was like this? Gah! Taught of the act! Who could... You! That son of a bitch! Not this time! We are gonna catch that asshole if it's the last thing we do! I'm smarter now! Wiser! Not gonna fall for his shenanigans! Not... not after last time! But, we need to catch him first. Ah! I see you! How do we get up there? I guess I need to go through here. I think this is- yeah, I go this way, right? Yeah, this is correct. And then out here. No, wait. Out here, right? Okay, we we made it. Now where did that asshole go? Where is he? I will destroy you. Hmm. Haven't seen him for a while. I hope I didn't take a wrong turn. Yes! We have him cornered! That's far enough! Come one step closer, and the Moogle gets it! Uh-oh. Huh, he has a hostage. This is a trouble. What are we gonna- oh? Kubo! Hmm, got a wild one. Ooh ah? Oh. You'll never get this golden hairpin! Uh, I actually won't. So here's the thing. We can choose between saving the Moogle or getting the treasure. Now, I'll be honest, usually I take the treasure. Because the thing is, you can get Mog later on. Um, and it doesn't matter if you don't get him this time. Except, it is advantageous to get him this time around because you can, uh, well, because then you have him earlier. You have more time to teach him magic, to increase his stats using espers, 
and to use a special ability, which we'll go into a moment. That plus also, I sort of want to see, want to do it this way, just for a change of pace. Because the Golden Hairpin is actually a really good accessory, it has the all MP costs, but we'll get something better, uh, eventually. Not to quite limit the game, though, to be honest. Anyway, let's save the Moogle! Thanks, Kubo! Evidently so. A Moogle who speaks the words of men! and can summon the Earth's power through his dance. It's Mog! An old dude named Rama taught me your language, Koopo! I'm gonna need to come up with a better voice for Mog, but... Whatever. He kept sh showing up in my dreams and telling me to help you, Koopo! So! I'm gonna help you, Kubo! Hmm, if that's how it's gonna be, then take this! And he jumps off the cliff with the golden hairpin. I'll wait in the airship for you, Kubo! And as long as we're here. Oh, what? I guess we can't interact with that. Okay, we're done in Narsh. Mmm, what is next? Next... is... Actually, nothing. Um, this is gonna be a really short episode, so sorry, but... Well, quite frankly, I need one or two short ones now, or uh, because I'm... Because otherwise, I'm not going to have enough to reach the end of the month. So... Oh hey, it's a... A what? What is that? Hmm... I wonder. Anyway, so, this is going to be a short one. The next one will probably be, be a short one. And the one after that as well. But after that, there'll be more regular length again. Again, I just need to do a few short ones, so as to make sure I can get through a particularly busy month. So, until next time, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VI with Chaos Blue, and have a good day. Bye!